In this video, we'll show you how to quickly build the Hopkins Towing Solutions RV Leveling Kit in four easy steps. In preparation, please check the contents of the package to ensure that the following items are included. Every kit will come with four ramps, two wheel docks, one non-skid traction mat, and 16 screws. Some of our kits include the Hopkins Towing Solutions wheel chalk, which is also sewed separately. In addition to these items, you will need the following tools. A circular saw, a square, a power drill, a pair of safety glasses, an eighth inch drill bit, a Phillips head bit, a tape measure, and a pencil. Before you begin, we recommend you read through the included instructions. If you have everything you need, building your kit should take about 30 minutes. The first thing you'll need to do is purchase a 2x8x8 board. We recommend it's treated lumber to withstand weathering. This will also act as a vital piece to the durability of your system. Here's a tip. If you write down the measurements from step 2, you can take them to the lumber yard and have them cut the boards for you. The second step is to measure and mark each of the boards. Let's start with the top board. Take the two wheel docks and place them on both sides of the trailer tire with the longer surface ends facing the tire. Make sure that it's square to the tire for proper measurement. Now measure from the outside end of the wheel dock to the outside end of the other. In this instance, it is 24 inches. Make note of this as it is essential to the measurements for the next two boards. Take that measurement and mark the first line on the board by measuring from the end. Make sure your lines are marked square. For the middle board, simply add 6.25 inches to the previous noted top board measurement. In this case, it is 24 inches plus 6.25 inches. Take that measurement and mark the next line on the board by measuring from the previous marked line. We're going to repeat that same step for the bottom board, only this time we will add 12.5 inches to the total length of the original top board measurement and mark from the end of the middle board line. In this case, it is 24 inches plus 12.5 inches. Take that measurement and mark the last line on the board by measuring from the previously marked line. At this point, your board should look something like this. Be sure to put on your safety glasses for step 3. Now, use the circular saw to make square cuts along the three marked lines, creating three separate boards. When you're finished cutting, the board should look similar to these. Now you're ready to assemble your risers. Starting with the bottom board, take two of the four ramps and place them on both ends of the board as you see here. Make sure the ends of each ramp are flush with the edge of the board. Using the two remaining ramps, repeat this process for the middle board. Now take the two wheel docks and place them at each end of the top board with the longer surface facing the center, forming the area that secures the wheel. Using the pencil, create pilot hole marks in the center of each hole on both the ramps and the wheel docks. Now remove the ramps and wheel docks and drill holes at each of your pilot hole marks with the eighth inch drill bit. To prevent splitting and ensure a firm connection, we recommend drilling only half an inch into the board. Starting with the bottom board, attach a ramp to each end with the screws provided. While tightening, make sure that the ramps remain flush to the ends. Follow these same steps to attach ramps to the middle board and wheel docks to the top board for completion of the heavy-duty RV leveling kit. When completed, your kit should look like this. You should also know that our leveling system can be customized to fit multi-axle RVs. We hope that you enjoy the use of your Hopkins Towing Solutions heavy-duty RV leveling kit, as well as years of simple, strong, and secure adventures. Hopkins Towing Solutions for a simpler and more rewarding towing experience.